spending time alone, working on yourself, reflecting, etc., is the work. That's the work. But later down the line, your life is going to be so much more enriched because of the wisdom that you have from the time that you were alone and the time that you were growing. It's 8.17 and I'm just gonna do my quick little summer makeup routine and then start work at nine. Primarily, I'm gonna be doing a lot of editing today. If you guys don't know and haven't been keeping up, I quit my corporate job. So I officially work for myself now. On top of that, I also handle all the content for my boyfriend and his company, as well as some like accounting admin tasks um, here and there, because that's what I went to school for. Yeah, I thought I would show you guys my summer makeup routine. It's a lot simpler these days because it's just so hot and I don't want to wear a lot of makeup. <laughs> and brows are done i just do like the same thing that i usually do the main difference in my makeup for the summertime is that i don't use foundation i've been loving how my skin has been looking lately except for this guy and i'm just like a lot tanner and i just feel a lot more radiant so i don't want to like cover it up with foundation i like to just use concealer so i'm using this dior concealer i use it to color correct under my eyes and then under my nose because I get red. I want to hide my blemish. My chin, a little bit on my forehead. That's it. I'm gonna do a quick spray. This is probably one of my favorite concealers because it's so creamy and like easy to blend out. Then I'm gonna use a brightening concealer. This is the one from Rare Beauty. So I'll just put concealer in my normal spots. And then I'll spray again. I'm gonna use this Milk Makeup Bronzer. I want to spray one more time. I swear this is the last time, but I just don't want my makeup to move. I'm gonna use some Rare Beauty Blush. And then to finish the look, I like to use a highlighting balm. This one is my absolute favorite. It's from Merit in the shade Bounce. It's so freaking good because it's so natural. I like to go on the high points up to my temple because when I turn to the side, this is what shows up in pictures. So I like to go all the way up, just like that. That's the look.
really quick i wanted to show you guys my new acrylic dry erase boards if you're like me and want to see everything like visually in front of you but you hate the look of dry erase boards i found these on amazon and they are literally perfect i love the acrylic look i have my calendar and then i have my little daily habits because i'm trying to be better every single day if i don't see it visually in front of me and if i don't make it interactive it just doesn't get done and i make an excuse as to why i didn't do my daily habits so i love that it's in front of me every single day i'll link those down below for you guys they're from amazon finished finalizing my boyfriend's first youtube video he's finally entering the youtube world and i'm really proud of this video his first video is a day in the life of a real estate investor and basically showing what he does in a day people just don't really know what he does for a living and he really wants to start taking content seriously hence why i'm helping out with editing scheduling planning scripting all the things just helping him out completely in this content space but yeah, i'm really proud of it and so i just scheduled it for it to be up tomorrow at noon i have one more video to edit of his and a few short form like tiktoks and reels to edit for him as well now i'm going to take a quick break get dressed and run some errands and then come back and edit some more this is my ootd to run my errands leo shirt is from realization par mini skirt is from princess polly these are the adidas campus shoes i ludicrously capacious bag is from amazon if you get that reference illy um if not you're probably not on tiktok it's already 91 degrees so i just want to be comfy just to not feel like wearing pants <laughs> didn't want to show my lunch because it's so chaotic um you're probably thinking like what on earth are you eating if you've been on tiktok you've seen this chicken sausage broccoli carrots some of my favorite chips from trader joe's and then this cottage cheese and mustard mixture i'm a snacker so honestly this keeps me full as a lunch Thank you. 
in this morning just answering emails and making sure my boyfriend's YouTube video was scheduled and everything was all good to go. Right now it's 9.52. I just straightened my hair because I washed it this morning. I just curled my lashes and put on some concealer on my little blemish. And that's the look for today because I don't feel like putting on makeup. I booked a evening cycle bar class tonight. So even more so I don't want to put on makeup to just have to like take it off. Also, Instagram threads came out yesterday and I downloaded it last night. And I definitely stayed up way too late just like going on threads hence why i woke up a little bit later today but i really love threads if you have threads make sure to follow me i kind of want to treat it as like a close friend story or like my notes app it's so funny it's like a little unhinged and like unfiltered and i love that but yeah follow me on threads it's so fun but anyways i'm gonna continue working i have to edit a ton more videos and short form content for my boyfriend and i also want to make a little content schedule for him so that we're kind of like organized with the amount of content that he's filming so that way i'm not waiting on him to give me raw footage to edit so yeah i'm gonna continue working <laughs> Is noon now and I decided I'm gonna take a break to run some errands I need to send out some parcels and then I want to go to the grocery store and get some strawberries to make a strawberry matcha this afternoon so I'm wearing this tube top that I thrifted um, a couple weeks ago um, I don't know how I feel about wearing a color but I like that it brings out my tan lines it makes me a little bit tanner um, and then I'm wearing the same mini skirt as yesterday at Fort Peter vibes these shoes are from Steve Madden and then I'm wearing the same black tote and then I have my hair in a clippy and that is the outfit about 3 15 right now and i have my little phone and tripod set up right now because i want to make a strawberry matcha and i want to film it and make like a little tiktok and an instagram reel so we need our strawberries i have my matcha and my frother and my agave syrup and can't forget my oat milk and i think that's all that we need I left like chunks in there because I feel like that'd be really yummy. Um, she looks promising. That is so good. Should have made the strawberries a little bit smaller. I was having a hard time getting to the straw. Oh my gosh. That's so good. I've been missing out like this whole time. I was always really hesitant to make these because I'm like, that looks disgusting, but. That is bomb. home from cycle bar literally got my butt whooped my hair is all crazy and greasy but i wanted to show you guys this pr package i think i legit manifested this last year my birthday i bought my first item from ysl i got this little card holder and during checkout i told my boyfriend i was like 
I'm gonna be on YSL's PR list. I even journaled about it. I journaled literally all the brands I'm gonna be on the PR list for. And literally like five months later, I get on their PR list. And I've been on it for about like six to eight months now. So yeah. A YSL package just came in the mail and I'm so freaking excited. It's more lippies. They send a lot of lippies to me. So I wanted to like show it to you guys because I wanted to make like a little Instagram story post about it. The packaging is actually insane. So they've sent me a lot of their like lip shines. So these are a bit different. These go on more of like a gloss, but, but these are lipsticks. So I'm so excited. I'm gonna unbox them and then take a little picture and upload it to my story. They've also sent me like these lash clashes in the past, which I'm in love with. They sent me two perfumes, this black opium and then this one as well, which I think I'm gonna give to my sister. They've also sent me their all hours foundation. But side note, look how organized my PR drawer is. It's like a candy jar. Mm -hmm. 